my fellow brothers who are walking the semen retention journey with me on this Tuesday, May 23rd, 2023. Guys, welcome. And I greet you, my brothers, who have put away your flesh, who have crucified the flesh, decided not to be a slave to the dark spirits of lust that enslave you guys. It really does. If you're addicted to PMO, or I like to call it PME, then you're a slave. And you don't really know it. I didn't know it for, you know, 53 years. Well, since 15 years old to 53, I've been a pme or a fapper. But now, guys, I'm on 225 days of being celibate or retaining the semen. And I got to give you an update. Sudden burst of energy yesterday and today, guys. I mean, I'm feeling like the first seven days when I started this and you get that sudden burst of energy. Well, that's what I've got right now. And I love it. I mean, you walk faster, you get out of your car faster, you're full of energy. It's it's the way we should feel all the time. So, semen retention works. Now, with that said, I have to tell you something that I discovered, at least for myself. When you... Gosh, what's the term, guys? Consume alcohol or drugs. It's going to take your energy away. It's going to block it. It's flat out what happened with me. So on this 225-day streak, there's been some times where I've relapsed into... Not relapsed on my semen, but with alcohol. You know, I'm trying not to drink. You know, I'm not an alcoholic, but I. it's not good for you. So there's been a couple times, guys, I've gotten drunk. You know, I've been at home in the evening and, you know, two beers turned into four. And I can get pretty drunk, I think, on four or five beers. Um, I've smoked a little cannabis here and there. And you know what? Cannabis, no good, guys. No good. I know it numbs the brain. It takes away some stress. There is some benefits, but they're not. The, the negatives far outweigh the benefits of cannabis. Now, if you were to like hit it like once a month or something and you didn't have any and you just like puffed a pipe with a buddy, that's not going to do anything. But if you've got it at home and you're consuming it two, three days in a row, it's going to block your energy, guys. Get rid of it. I'm struggling with that and the alcohol, even though I don't really consume much of either, I'm trying to purge it from my life. Those are dark spots on my soul. But sudden burst of energy, guys, just an update. I'm really feeling the energy hitting the gym again, strict diet. So here's the key, clean and sober and retaining the seed, guys. Those are the the keys. So stay sober Retain your seed. No peeking. No looking at... Uh, I know it's hard when you're out in public. I mean, I see the the beautiful women everywhere, guys. It's hard. But battle the mind. So, you know, number one, battle the lustful thoughts. Don't look at things on your own. Number two, don't use mind-altering substances. Number three, retain your seed. And I think I would throw in, you know, get some good rest and drink lots of water. And then number five, not everyone does this, but I believe a good diet helps. It it keeps your weight down. It keeps the food clean. Your digestive system is running optimal. And then for me personally, I like to do what's called uh, intermittent fasting, or basically what you do is you only eat in a certain window of the day. So for me personally, I wake up and I won't eat till around between 12 noon and 2 p.m. Somewhere in that time, I'll I'll eat lunch. And then I'll eat dinner around 5 or 6, and then that's it. And what I'm trying to do, guys, is eat good, healthy food. No fast food. Don't eat fast food. That's 
going to block your energy and weigh you down, make you tired. So those things, guys. That's all I got for you today. Love you guys. I'm praying for you guys. I have you on my list. You know who you are. Pray for me too. And let's be souls of light and love. And I know it's hard, guys. It's hard to love other people when they're angry and pissed and mean. I am still learning myself. But let's get out there and be the best we can be today. Talk to you guys later.